Standing is a critical hurdle for any plaintiff challenging government regulations to surmount. The plaintiff must demonstrate a personal, real stake in the controversy's outcome. Did the plaintiff in Summers v. Earth Island Institute succeed? A federal statute required the United States Forest Service to establish a notice, comment, and appeal process for certain proposed projects and activities. The service enacted regulations exempting smaller projects from these requirements, including small salvage timber sales of 250 acres or less. After a fire burned a substantial area of the Sequoia National Forest, the service approved a salvage sale of timber on 238 acres, called the Burnt Ridge Project, or Burnt Ridge. Consistent with its new regulations, the service followed no notice, comment, or appeal procedures for Burnt Ridge. Earth Island Institute, an environmental protection organization joined by smaller groups, sued the service and Priscilla Summers, district manager for the Sequoia National Forest, challenging the new regulations as contrary to the statute. An Earth Island member testified by affidavit that he'd repeatedly visited the Burnt Ridge area and planned to do so again, and that his interest in enjoying the area would be harmed if the service completed the timber sale without hearing the ideas he would have shared if given the chance to comment. Another Earth Island member, Jim Benzman, asserted via affidavit that he'd visited many national forests and planned to visit more, and that future salvage timber sales would harm his recreational interests. The district court granted a preliminary injunction against the Burnt Ridge sale. The parties thereafter settled their dispute about Burnt Ridge. The service then argued that because Earth Island hadn't identified any other specific project threatening its members with injury, Earth Island lacked standing to continue challenging the regulations. The district court rejected the service's argument, invalidated several of the regulations, and issued a national injunction against applying them. The Ninth Circuit affirmed the district court with respect to some of the regulations. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.